Uh, hey, you still there? Um, alright, good. Uh, you did hide in a different room, right? Um, alright, cool. So, uh, where'd you hide? The bathroom at the end of the hall. Um, okay. Um, there should be some, uh, chemicals in there or something. If someone comes in, spray it in their face. It'll probably make them leave because they'll be annoyed. Um, oh, wait. Uh, it might only work on shy and nervous ghosts. So, um, use it if someone, uh, quietly comes in. If a more aggressive ghost violently enters your room, stare at the camera until they leave, as the chemicals may not work. Um, alright, that should do it, uh... Oh, uh, I forgot to mention this before, but, uh, do you remember that person named Max I mentioned? Well, the reason why he was pa the reason why he passed away was because, well, he was found murdered in this very building. Yeah, it was... Y you know what, never mind. I don't want to creep you out more than you already are. Uh... All right, well, uh, stay safe, man. You got this, Thomas.
Hey there, you still okay? Okay, great. Um, we're gonna do this alright so far, so uh, where'd you hide? Um, the, the, the pool? The pool. Why would you hide in a pool? That room is so open! Well, it's not that big, but, but still. It's fairly bright, so if someone walks in, they can see you. And the only way to hide is to jump in the water. Okay, so remember, if you jump in the water, don't forget to breathe. And also, when we investigated that house, we realized that the temperature regulator was off. The pool would heat up very fast. Now, you can't control it, but I'm pretty sure it's in the, um... The, uh, what's it called? The, uh, storage camera. Again, I uh, keep making sure the water temperature is around middle, because I do not think you want to jump in if it's too hot or cold. Also, the ghost may try to go in as well, or maybe there's a ghost in there. If you see someone in there, look away from them. And also, yeah, wait for them to go away, and, um, you know, wait till they're gone. And, uh, that should be all for tonight. Stay safe, and please do not try and hide in the pool again.
Thomas, it's been a while now, hasn't it, since our last little encounter? <laughs> you must have felt so good after you got away from me. But now, I'm back. To continue our little game. Call it a part two of the game, if you will. This time, however, it's a game you can't win. Get ready, Thomas. I'm coming. <laughs> Hello? Uh, hey, sorry for calling you late. I had a lot of paperwork to do, so, uh, I hope you're not that mad at me for being late. Now, uh, where are you? The attic. Okay, interesting spot. That might actually be a decent, um, spot to be in. Uh, okay, if I remember correctly, there should be a light for you to use. So, you'll need to use that if you want to keep the ghost away, but it has limited power. Because everything in this house, apparently, is either broken or has limited power. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, also, yeah, you'll need to use the cameras because the room is basically impossible to see in without the light. And, uh, what else is there? Uh, oh yeah, ghosts can probably turn on the light too, so if they turn it on, make sure to look away at the cameras. And remember, avoid eye contact at all costs because, you know, if you look at them, they'll get aggressive. You should know this by now already, so, uh... Alright, so, uh, stay safe and I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'll try and call on time next time. Uh, goodbye.
Look, there he is. Hey, stop right there. <laughs> what, Rosalina? Do it now.